everyone it's me again with a quick one so let's say you have a data that you are trying to import into your civil 3d and it's just giving you problems so i'm just quickly going to open a, a file extension in a notepad so this is now opened in a notepad you just say control all you copy you open your excel you paste it into excel so it's saying that the data that you're trying to paste into Excel, the size of it is not as it was in the notepad. You just say OK. So as you can see, our data didn't separate the northing, easting and the elevation is reading it as one text or one word. So what you do, uh, you quickly go under your data tab. Under data tools, there's text to column. You click on text to column. It will ask you that do you want to separate, do you want characters such as commas or tabs to separate each field? Or do you want um, characters such as spaces? Do you want spaces to be the ones to separate each field? So in my case, I don't have any commas and I don't seem to be having tabs, but I do have spaces in between my nothing, easting and elevation. So I'm just gonna leave it at fixed width. Then you say next. As you can see now, it has separated your easting, nothing, and also your elevation. And then you just say finish. So now, if you look at it, it's in columns. So all that you have to do now is just to save this into a CSV comma delimited, which is now a file um, extension that Civil 3D will be able to recognize and read. And then you just say file, you come here, there it is. It says CSV comma delimited. So you choose that one and you save it. And as soon as you're done, when you open your civil 3D and you import it, it's voila. I hope this short video will be able to help you with other file formats that you are unable to import into your civil 3D. Alrighty. Bye.